All right, show them the colors we got. Okay, so this is um, a light purple, and what I'm going to do is I'm going is I'm going to do paint all my big dresser this color, but the drawers. So we're gonna do the drawer. Okay. Tell them what you're gonna do. Then for the drawers, I'm gonna paint them this color, as you can see. So the whole body is gonna be that, but the drawer is gonna be this, and we're gonna do the reverse for this, right? So yes. we're gonna do the whole body light purple, then and the then drawers. we're gonna paint these parts dark purple. Uh, this gold spray paint for all of our hardware, right? So and this purple. Oh, that's for our side tables that we're gonna start working on soon. Yes. And. We got all of this at Home Depot. Yep. Oh, you can um, start hosing off our pieces of vintage whatever that stuff is so we can clean it up so we can start painting those. Okay. Alrighty, so we got that piece primed. I'm about to clean this piece. Got my primer out. I'm going to prime that. That one's done. I got the drawers drying and then we'll go and paint them with our colors. I'm gonna use some OxyClean and just clean all this gunk off and then prime it. All right, before we start painting, I forgot we have to take the hardware off. So we're just gonna unscrew this. So I hit that with the dark purple on those drawers and then I hit the outside of this I left the inside because we're gonna do those in lighter purple and then I left the drawers over here We're gonna do those in lighter purple. So I'm doing all the dark purple parts first and you can see it's kind of blotchy So this is dry and I'm gonna go over it with a second coat now So here's our second color. It looks very similar, but I noticed when this dries it gets a lot darker or darker color so hopefully you can see a difference if not we just wasted our time i did this with our table bow back too i wanted two different grays and they ended up being so similar you can't see the difference so i'm hoping you guys can see it especially if we do a pattern it might be subtle enough that you could tell So that's one coat, so it's definitely lighter, but I have a feeling it'll dry a lot darker because this one started out super light and when it dried, it got really dark. So I'm gonna do like two more coats and then I got a little schmutz. So luckily I have the darker color right here with a brush to touch up after that dries. So that's the one thing about doing two different colors on a piece of furniture is you gotta be careful or you're gonna have to go back and forth with the colors. So it's actually a big drastic difference. So we'll see when it dries what it actually looks like. And I'm using the Rust-Oleum Specialty Metallic in gold, even though that picture's silver. This is gold. And we're gonna spray paint the bases of these gold because that's what Briley wanted. So I think I'm gonna do both of them gold. <laughs> 